I have brought my new assistant with me in her new beekeeping suit which she got for her birthday today. Happy ninth birthday Olivia, yay! Anyway, <laughs> she's very pleased with herself. Happy so, birthday, Olivia. We are going to be doing a Varroa mite treatment. We've got some of these Baverol strips. We've not used these before, so we'll be sussing out how these work. Um, we do know that we've got Varroa mites already because of the last check. I noticed some of the bees had jagged wings, which is a pretty good sign. Um, well, not such a good sign. But we're also going to be doing a sugar roll test as well, just to see you know what kind of infestation we're looking at and then we'll do another sugar roll test sometime after the treatment and just just compare see how it's gone so I do understand the alcohol wash is probably a bit more um, accurate they reckon but I'm just a bit wimpy about killing bees at the moment so <laughs> we'll start with this maybe some other time I'll do the alcohol wash test. Fancy? Yeah, it's a big giant juicy one here. Lucky I'm wearing gloves or this would be Dad's job. Oh my! We've been building a, building a web. Oh, no, no, not to kill our bees. Uh, you're in protective armour, love. <laughs> okay, the new one. So I got a new, I got a free beehive tool when we bought the baby roll stuff. So I don't know if it's any better or worse than the other one, but I'm a little bit angled, so you know. I'll be a bit. There's another spider. They can stop making hey, homes Mom, around here. Activities. Is there any reason we, do, we don't want them making homes around here or do they just well, kill bees? I noticed this one had been building a web across there and one of the bees had gotten stuck in the web. Oh no, you leave our girls alone. Yeah. And boys. Well, so far, I'm liking the look of the old one better. So far, the old one's working better. <coughs> yeah. What old? Maybe it's a bit thinner. Yeah, <laughs> chucking the old one back. <laughs> This one looks better, in my opinion. Yeah. Oh yeah. It must be a bit thinner or something. That kind of talk for the camera. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, look at all that. Oh, you've been busy again. You're supposed to be making it in the... Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh my god, they've cleaned out all the sugar water. There's not okay. one drop left. <coughs> and the all never more. Oh wow, they have two. We're going to have to make up some more. So, when we're testing for the Varroa mite, we want to go for the ones in the brood cells apparently, which are down the bottom here. Oh, what's that? Oh, look at all the... Oh, there's plenty honey. of nectar. See the shiny stuff, Olivia? Yeah. The, the shiny bits. No, no. See, like up here, they're shining. What? Yeah, it's yep. nectar. nectar. See them all sticking their heads down and bums up. Are they larvae? Storing nectar. No, 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 there aren't any larvae in this top one because the queen isn't up here. Do not let go of it. Do not panic is and it, let go or anything. Is it heavy? No. No, it's, it's not heavy. Just let's grab it on top. Just pinch it. Yep. That's it. Right, come here <laughs> and show the camera what you got. Oh yeah. Good job, Olivia. Let's see you do Mom, it. Can you hold it now? <laughs> I can <laughs> hold it now. <laughs> so I can study it properly. <laughs> all the nectar on there, all those shiny oh. bits. Oh, oh and see the stuff that they've capped? That's going to be honey. Where? Oh yes. See they started capping it? Let me see. see. If I can, uh... Not sure if the camera's picking up on it. Where? See how there's a, a few drops there that are sort of... Yeah, oh this one's actually over. quite a bit heavier than the last ones we've picked up. I have promised, should my YouTube channel ever be monetized, we'll invest in a really good camera. <laughs> so we can capture more close-up type stuff. See oh, how yep, there we go, that's a See yeah. the how they're starting to cap it over, that's their honey store for the winter. Yay! Good on you, Buzzbees. Mm. Need oh, no, to spot the busy. queen bee. Because when we're testing for mites, we need to get about a half a cup of bees, which is about 300 bees. And you don't want to go knocking the queen bee around. She's one we don't want to upset. Ah, got her. Oh, have you got her already? Yeah, because I'm that good. There she is on top of the... Yep. The bee up my arm. Yeah, I desperately want to put this down. Okay. <laughs> well, see all the capped over ones on these, Olivia? 
That's the worker bees. Larvae turning into worker bees. Mm. I'm going to grab one of these, one of the ones that I know has not got the queen because we've already spotted the queen. So we want to give this a shake, don't we? Yep. So that a whole heap of bees. I'm standing back. Whoa! Enough. Look at that swarm! Might have to do another and look at all those yep. ones! So, I want to get about half a cup of bees, which will be about 300 of them. Pop them in there. <laughs> Sorry, yep. bees. Now, Clint has, <laughs> Clint has makeshifted, made a uh, shaker. No, they put mesh on top, you want little holes. Yeah, 3.3 to 3.5 mils uh, wide. Yep, that's the one. <laughs> so <laughs> then, we want to get some icing sugar. Look at all them on the floor. Hope you didn't damage it. Oh, is that the drone? That, that... Oh, yeah, look, there's a drone. Hope it's not the queen. No, it wasn't the queen. All right. So you want about <laughs> two tablespoons of icing sugar. I'm just going to sort of guess because I didn't bring a tablespoon measure with me. about two tablespoons easy isn't it? Uh, that's about half a cup but that's fine yeah it, it doesn't okay. matter <laughs> I'm avo deed then there's quickly. some bees in there gorging themselves <laughs> yes well well it'll help get the mics off them now the Whoa. idea is I got the free right, hand right. yeah now oh, go away pull it back on and we'll give these. I want to give them a bit of a roll. I know the bees won't be particularly impressed with me right now. But they'll be covered in sugar. And we'll just sugar. leave them for a minute or so. Hey, that one's covered The idea in sugar. is the mites do not stick to the sugar, or the sugar makes the uh, makes the mites come off. Now, when I say sugar, we mean um, icing sugar, or some people call it powdered sugar, don't they? Yeah. So, yeah. In America, I think you call it powdered sugar, but it's icing sugar here in New Zealand. So yeah, these poor little buggers are now wondering what on earth is going on. Are they happy or are they sad? Uh, I'd say they're not very impressed. <laughs> they're kind of like drowning in a pool of chocolate, I suppose. You know, would you be happy? Would you be sad? Bit of both, maybe. Good way to go. <laughs> but no, this this does not kill them. It just makes them a bit annoyed. We've got a white plate with just a little bit of water on it. Right. Same so way. Shake, 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 shake. Shake, shake, shake. In theory, sugar. if we've got any mites, should see them coming out. I haven't seen any mites see. coming out yet. Yeah, no mites though. The idea is meant to be, if you see three or more mites, you might want to look this at one. treating. Yep, yep, you can see one there. The bumbles are happy about that sugar. But simply because ours have got jagged wings, as I say. There's a couple of spiders in there. We're, a couple of spiders. We're going to treat them regardless, so. It's a bit of stuff from the grass around the plate, but. Uh... And now we're going to do the humane thing and release them from there. Yes. <laughs> release oh. them back in there, all the albino bees. <laughs> they'll and they'll just clean them. themselves up, and the other bees will have fun cleaning themselves up. <laughs> Bit of a sugar party. So there's, a, there's sort of about two there, wasn't there? There's one there, see? Yeah. Right, right, yep. Finger. And there's is that one or it's just a bit of dirt? Oh that's an, oh no, there goes two there. Oh yeah. So that's definitely one. Oh yeah, that's that's definitely one there. But, uh, actually not as many as I was expecting. No. But as I say, the signs are there that we've got them, so we are gonna treat. It's about the right time of year. Now, one way I have heard as well of treating them for Varroa is actually just shaking a whole heap of icing sugar all over the hive. Um, I've never actually heard anyone that I, I know recommend to do that, but that, that is one of the things that I read. You can shake icing sugar all over them. Do it, Mum, do it. And it helps to... <laughs> we haven't got a sticky board or anything underneath to gauge how well it's doing, but we'll do another sugar roll anyway after we've put these strips in. So. Um, yeah, we'll put these strips in and see how we go with that. They come in packets of four. They reckon you only possibly need two. But they also say as soon as you open the packet, you have to use them. So 
may as well use all four of them. Hopefully we're not doing anything really wrong by doing that. I'm sure they'd say on the packet if we were. But they just look like that. Fold these bits together and they just pop over on top of the on top of the honeycomb like that. So That's all very combed down here, well, so pretty much. Yeah. So excuse me. Strip them coming through. Beep beep. Maybe. Don't you bee brush. Okay, Clint's doing this because my gloves are that clumsy. <laughs> One. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. Just like that. There we go. If any bees need brushing off, I can do it. <laughs> Now we only have these in for six to eight weeks and then we get rid of them. Yes, you're not meant to leave them in any longer than that. Sugar bees. See my friend? Right on my head. Your friend. Oh, yep. Hello, Olivia's friend. <laughs> and I got stung right there. Yes, he did. And I didn't even cry much. much. Right, you have to pop it back in. Nice and slow. So the bees can move out of the way. Yep. Yay! <laughs> That's a good first step, Olivia. I might want to do 